what's going on guys drums and dogs here and we're here with a follow-up review to the hella far h802 little micro drone that i picked up off amazon for like eleven dollars and some change and i already did an unboxing of this guy and i already did the outdoor flight of this guy we're just gonna do the little quick indoor flight of this guy so here's the drone really nice looking little drone the Helifar H802 really nice looking quadcopter and as you know it has these little built in prop guards around it protecting it and it's actually it performs pretty well actually for these little uh, built in little prop the only little bendable part on this guy is these little ends right here other than that the frame is actually pretty sturdy and it has a bright white LED light on the front of the quadcopter really bright and nice for orientation and it has a red LED in the back of the quadcopter that's really nice battery bay is underneath here's the battery bay okay and you just push down on this guy open it up there's your battery right there 3.7 volt 330 milliamp hour battery and you get two batteries with this guy and you get the included charger which is really nice. This is a really nice little setup for like eleven dollars and like sixty cents. I think it was on Amazon. It's not too bad for this little guy. Comes with extra prop, and it's really nice. Little fun to fly flyer. Comes with three speed rates. Really nice altitude hold flyer. Here's the transmitter. Really nice sturdy looking transmitter. Uh, only down thing is that the buttons are not labeled. The only label buttons is the buttons on top. Here's your flip and roll button. Here's your high low speed button, speed control button. And um, then you have the buttons on the interface that are not labeled. You have your throttle stick, pitch and roll stick. These buttons don't do anything. These unlock. This button right here is to unlock and lock the motor button. This is your um, headless mode or what they would call carefree mode this is your um, one key return and then this is your forward trim backward trim um, left trim right trim and emergency stop the motors and to calibrate the gyros you want to go down and inboard on both sticks to calibrate the gyros and like I said speed flips three AAA batteries in the back three triple A's and you're ready to go so only thing that's not included is the triple A batteries and that's not that's the only thing that's not included for this ready to fly setup so you will have to provide your own batteries other than that it's a nice drone man on the back it tells you everything that you need so really nice setup we're gonna do a quick indoor flight of this guy let me know what you guys think of this um, Helifar H802 indoor flight. Excuse me. Get a quick indoor flight of this guy real quick. Alrighty, guys. Drones and dogs here. And we are here for the indoor flight of the Helifar H802. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this. Turn the power switch on. On and off switch on the top. Lights begin to flash rapidly set it down turn on the transmitter up down lights flash once and we're bound to the transmitter now we should be able to do down and inboard for a level calibration lights flash really quickly and that should give us a level calibration we're gonna go ahead and hit this unlock to unlock the motor button and let's go ahead and lift up take off so this is our first rate right here our first rate it's kind of drifting forward a little bit giving it a little trim there's an altitude hole right there not too bad a little bit of a drift Let's see if I can uh, trim that up a little bit 
First rate, not too bad. So there we go. There's a hover. There's our yaw. First rate. There's our yaw in the first rate. Really slow. Really slow yaw in the first rate. Here's our pitch. Moving around in the first rate. Here's our pitch. Full pitch. All right, let's go for a higher rate. Gonna click this button. Two beats, that's a higher rate. So there's our yaw rate right there. And then second rate, or intermediate rate. There's our yaw rate. Here's our pitch. A lot more tilt on it. Look at that. A lot more tilt. And then second rate. That. Get in close on this guy. Get a close up on it. Ooh, losing a little bit of altitude right there. So, three beats. A lot faster y'all rate. A lot faster, almost too fast. Look at that. Look at the cyclones on it. And the third rate, really tight cyclones. Really nice and fast. A lot more pitch in the third rate. A lot more tilt on it. Look at that. That yaw rate is really uh, twitchy. The yaw rate is really twitchy in that third rate. I really like the second rate better in the house. So I'm back in the second rate. Back in the second rate. Flips on it. Nice flips, all directional. So this is the second rate right here. And we're just gonna fly around in this second rate. I like it, I like it more better in the second rate. Yeah, so not a bad indoor flyer. Not bad. Sometimes you do got to give it a little throttle because it seems like it wants to go down a little bit. Sometimes. But after two hold is not that bad. Not too bad. Nice looking little flyer. Bright LED light in the front. White LED light in the front. Look at that. Close up on that guy. Hellafar H8. Zero two. Boy drones and dogs. So yeah, not a bad indoor flyer. And those built-in little prop guards act really well. So if you was to crash against something, I don't see you harming nothing or harming the quadcopter itself. Nice looking little drone. 11 bucks. Looks like 11 bucks and 60 cents on Amazon. There's our flashing lights. Go ahead and hit this uh, land button. There you go. Hellafar H802. Your boy Drones and Dogs. Appreciate you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We're going to catch you guys in the next review. Appreciate you guys.